All right, we're on. We're going. We're doing it. The most, the, the much anticipated Luigi's Mansion, the Luigi game, the Halloween special, the Halloween game. We're playing it. We're doing it tonight. We're doing it live. We're doing it on the 3DS. Here we go, fellas. I said it was coming. We're finally here. New file for... Oh, wait. New file. Uh, here we go. New game. What are we doing here? You can adjust the screen brightness. There are four levels. Brightness is four. The dimension dimness is one. Until you can't see the ghost. I can't see the ghost here. Playing with 3D on, fellas. It's in a massacre. Welcome. We're playing Luigi's Mansion tonight. We're starting it right now. The Halloween stream. Spooky game. It's just me tonight. Nick went to bed. I have no work tomorrow. It's been a long time coming. I was going to do this. I've been playing Pokemon Coliseum for too long. We're doing a new game tonight. Like we got a little specter action going on here. Drop the key. And it went through the top door. Here it is. Finally, the much anticipated, long awaited Luigi game, Luigi's Mansion. The original Luigi's Mansion, except this is the port on the 3DS. Luigi's Mansion 1, let's have some fun. We said we were going to do it. We're doing it. It's finally happening. Tonight's the night. Nick's in bed. He's got work tomorrow. I don't. I'm staying up. I'm playing this game. The dog's on the other couch. He's asleep. That's how we're doing it tonight. Nice and spooky. I love the sounds this guy makes.
This house, I swear, seems to have more ghosts every day. What's a young fella like you doing around here, anywho? Uh-oh, this looks ugly. All right, youngster, look lively. Follow me, post-haste. All right, there we go. There's our big bad guy, King Boo. So your name's Luigi. I think our paths were destined to cross. Well met, Luigi. Hmm. Where's this, you ask? Yeah, I'd like, I would like to know where this is. Why, these cozy quarters are where I do my ghost studying. Professor Egad's Ghost Research Laboratory. Egad, this is the guy who made Flood and Mario Sunshine also. The lab, if you're shorten, of a shortening mind. You won this mansion in a contest you didn't even enter? Sounds pretty fishy to me. So you believe the mansion actually exists then? Strange. Ah, it's an illusion. The mansion's not real. I've been living here since I was a lad of 20 or so. And I'll tell you, that mansion appeared just a few days ago. But when you go into the mansion, he says that more and more ghosts have appeared by the day. The spirits have fooled you. I don't know if it's a dream or an illusion or what, but I surely won't be too happy winning a haunted house. Now that I get a look at you, I just recalled a guy with a red hat Kind of like you went up to that mansion without even stopping to chat, and he never returned. Was he a dream too? So that was Mario. But here's the thing. Luigi won this mansion. He doesn't even know that Mario was, like, kidnapped in that mansion. Like, he's walking around in the mansion, and he goes, Mario! What? That guy was your brother? Oh, no, that's horrible. He wouldn't stand a chance against these ghosts without my help. You have to go after him. Here's the plan. I'll teach you how to deal with ghosts so you can rescue your brother, Luigi. Standard sidestep. Luigi will walk facing the direction that you slide with the circle pad towards. Circle pad will control sidesteps and Luigi will walk facing one direction. Yes, yeah, this is what we're doing. What is this? A regular flashlight shining its light on ghosts will surprise them. Use A button to turn it off. Use A button to emit a powerful ghost scare scaring light. Charge it up to increase the area of its effects. Original. Gotcha. While vacuuming, hold B and use a circle pad to turn as you vacuum. Okay. Present with the light when they get close, seeing power in the opposite direction. Got it. Okay, real training starts now.
Ho, 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 ho. Alright, time to get two at the same time. Oh, good. That's great. The Game Boy Horror. Is that a Virtual Boy? No, that's a Game Boy Horror. Oh wow, that was the uh, Mario 64 sound that we got in there. Look at that, look at that clear see-through Game Boy. Translucent. I wish I wish I had my translucent uh, analog pocket, but I wasn't able to get that. All right, so in this game, they made this just as I think Luigi's Mansion 3 was coming out. So they implemented that Gooigi into this 
version of the game, so you could play co-op on the 3DS version of Luigi's Mansion 1, which is pretty cool. There he is, there's Luigi. Even if he's defeated, he can revive as many times as he wants. Take a care of Luigi. Sounds like he's pretty impervious to anything that can happen. Alright, to the mansion. Here we go. Yeah, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Just going to that mansion that just popped up outside your lab. Nice and spooky. Nice and spooky. When did this toad get here? This toad wasn't here before. He's crying over there. Is he real or is he an illusion too? All right, so toads was what allows us to save. How nice a mirror, spooky. Oh, there's coins here now. I'm trying to clean this place up a little bit. Right, let's see if we can go in here. That's a no. about over here? This is where we found Egad before. Uh, coins. Okay, let's blow out these candles. Make it nice and dark in here. You know, set the tone. There we go. Who put out my candles? You, Mr. Lime Green? Well, dark rooms are dangerous around here, yes. They love the dark, and now they will get you. Now you're in for it. Blugga, huh? Just like the red cap before you. May you wander lost in darkness forever. That's pretty pleasant. Calling Luigi Little Man. He's canonically the tallest person in Mario. There 
There we go. That tells you what keys to use where. I guess in a way this ain't like Zelda. I played through this game once before, but it was a little while ago now. So I'm still like refreshing myself. Let's see how many coins I can get. Oh, there we go. Gotta get some money. No money here. Money. Money, 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 money. Money, 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 money. Hey, Joey, finally playing Luigi's Mansion. Yep, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I said I was going to do it. We got to do it for Halloween, you know? I don't have Nick on here with me today. I'm not grinding out Pokemon. We're playing Luigi's Mansion. Like I said I was going to do. It's been long awaited. Long overdue. When I was posting all my videos on YouTube, I was like, there's way too many Pokemon Coliseum ones. I need to expand my genres. Come on. There you are. Gotcha. Ghostbusters. Trying to find the money. Hidden money. Because I know at the end of this game it ranks you. With all the money that you found, you could buy yourself a mansion. And I want a mansion. I don't want a little shack. First time I played this game, I got a little shack. I don't want a little shack. I want some nice real estate. Luigi's got to get his money right. So that way... Uh, you know, the honeys like Daisy won't come over and hang out with them. It's after 1 a.m. and I started streaming. I started streaming after 1 a.m. So you're going to have to... And I'm doing this alone. You're going to have to bear with the delusions, fellas. There you go. Well, the lights didn't turn on, so there's something else over here. Oh, these two men. Up, there's still more in here. Another banana man. Got 
Gotta get my money back. I just keep dropping my coins. All right, the lights still haven't turned on. There must be something else going on here. Where's the other ghost? Uh, some money. Come on, open on up. Up, oh, there's a, there's a ghost. All right, lights are on. No more ghosts. Maybe coins anywhere. Oh, there's a key. Come to me, key. I played this game when it was new like 20 years ago, but the 3DS version is much better, and this game actually makes use of the little control stick above the A, B, X, Y button on the... Yeah, that, that it does. That it does. Um, I've never played the GameCube version. I was actually thinking about buying the GameCube version to do this stream, but I didn't because it was, it was pretty expensive on Amazon, actually. I think it was around like 80 bucks from what I was seeing. And I figured I already had this version. I love the 3DS. I love streaming on the 3DS. Looks nice and pretty. We'll just stick with this version for now. And then you know what? There's going to be some uh, continuity if I continue with the Luigi Miss Mansion games and like go on to do Luigi's Mansion 2, which is for the 3DS. I heard they're actually porting Luigi's Mansion 2 to the Switch also, so there's that. So maybe I'll just switch over to the Switch and we'll have some continuity there for Luigi's Mansion 2 and then Luigi's Mansion 3. GameCube games are expensive right now. The system is going through nostalgia hour for everyone. Yeah. Yeah, it is. The GameCube and the 3D and the uh, and the Game Boy Advance are going through their nostalgia eras. Game Boy Advance games are expensive too. The crazy thing though is I feel like I've seen Luigi's Mansion for the GameCube, like in a video game store, retro game store near me, pretty recently for like significantly cheaper I mean it's probably not there anymore and I've noticed with me things feel like the other day and they were like a year ago but I might be able to find it cheaper elsewhere if I do a little digging and I'm lucky alright so I've noticed that if I come back and I re-explore these rooms more money spawns so maybe that's how I get to the good ending, the good mansion of this game. So I have to just keep re-going through the mansion, re-picking up coins. Come on. Nope. Re-cleaning up the cobwebs. I feel like I'm Sisyphus rolling the rock up the, the hill because i got to keep coming back and doing this over again. I was thinking for a second that vase might like roll over. No. The vibes kind of remind me of the Haunted Mansion from Disney World. Luigi.
All right, here we go. So this seems like it's a boss battle we got coming up. Oh, look, just follow the coins. Ooh, piece of candy. 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 Ah, I dropped my candy. I don't like these ghost mice. I don't, I don't understand. What am I doing here? All right, you know, let's let's get out of this room, and we'll go through this one where they wanted us to go. Oh, that's good. That's that's great. That's fantastic. Should have seen that one coming. Should have been looking on my map. That's my own dang fault. All right. Nope, oh, yep, more of these mice steal my money. Okay, let's try to do this again. Alright, so the guy is here. I took a picture of his heart, right? Here we go. There you go. And go ahead and try to find me. I can see you, but you can't see me. That's not true. I'm looking at you right now. Ho, 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 ho. Okay, Santa. Anytime, anywho, I'm getting very sleepy. Losing my money every time that happens to me. All right, I found a jewel. All right, that wasn't bad. Hannah is awesome. Oh, welcome back. I remember you. You were here on the um, the Mario Party stream. We did some Mario Party a few days ago. Um, about a week ago, we did Mario Party 1. Missed you. Welcome back in. I added you on, um, I added you on, on my Switch. Believe it or not, you're like my only other friend on Switch other than like one of my other legitimate friends from actual life so we, we got that going on and I will have you know since I last spoke to you I did set up a discord account I haven't used it much but we got to figure out a time when we could do the Mario party against the two of us because I know that you said you wanted to do that challenge and I'm down for that I, I don't I, I still have not figured out how to work it What's your, what's your Discord name? I'll, I'll add you on Discord. Is, is it Hannah is awesome again? I'll whoop your booty. I'm looking forward to it. I, I love a good challenge. I think that would be a fun thing to do on stream. 
And you know something, I, I clicked on your profile on, on Switch. You probably will. I've seen you put in a lot of time onto these games. You put in a lot more time onto it than I have, so you'd probably kick my ass, but I'm still down for it. Because I said I was going to do it, I got to do it. Playing Luigi's Mansion tonight, though. We've been playing a lot of Pokemon Coliseum. I've been playing a lot of Pokemon Coliseum with my brother. But I'm taking a break because he's he's got work tomorrow. Good, that's that's great. You'll love to see that. And I gotta play something spooky for Halloween. That's why I'm here and that's why I'm doing this. Discord name is Hannah is awesome. All right, I'm going to add you on Discord. I can remember that. Hannah is awesome. All right, the master bedroom. Oh, is, is this another boss? Here we go. All right, here's her heart. And isn't my hair just gorgeous? Of course it is. I do spend a lot of time on it. I was so bored, cooped up in that painting. Now I'll spend all my time in front of the mirror. It... All right. So how are we going to get this lady? All right. And I'm not scaring her. Let me just explore this room. No one's throwing any books at me, so I can explore a little bit. Maybe I'll ruin the lighting for her. Maybe she won't like that. Such a draft. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. That's it. All right, here we go. Let's ruin her lighting again. Let's put the draft in here. There she goes. And, yeah, go check that out. Trying to pick up those pearls. Pearls there, pearls there. All right, go, go fix that draft, lady. Nope, that didn't do it this time. That's two, two bosses. Love the, the Yoshi profile. Love the big Yoshi. I just play a Yoshi game, actually. I got, on this 3DS, in the bottom of it, I have, um, I got Yoshi's Wooly World. You can't see it, but it's here. You gotta trust me on it. I, I've never beaten it. I think I've played through a world on it, but maybe I'll do that one on stream. Do a nice Yoshi game after I get through some Luigi. See, I've been criticized. I've been criticized for playing too much Mario games. My cousin Frank says I should lean into it. He says I should, if I should play these Mario games, I should just get straight up, get dressed up as Mario when I play these games. So, you know, I... I Tried to go off script a little bit, play a lot of Pokemon, play some Pokemon Coliseum. The thing is, it's a long game. You get wrapped up in it. I mean, it doesn't have to be a long game, but, like, I want to take my time with it. I want to enjoy it. It's a fun one to do with my brother because we both love that game. But now that I'm not with him and it's Halloween, we're doing some spooky games. We're going with Luigi now. 
I don't like these little mice. Alright. Here we go. 3DS is great. I love the 3DS. It's one of my favorite consoles. Mario Kart 7 for 3DS is great too. Yeah, you're right. I like to take my time exploring everything. Yeah, I want to go through it slow. You know, I want to... I want to immerse myself in it and make this feel lived in. Like, I'm going to live in this mansion for a little bit here. I feel like the little kids' rooms are always creepier for some reason. All right, let's check out this guy's heart. Yeah, this little ghost, this little ghost boy is going to be the hardest one yet. Ah, oh, this is great. Check this out. The 3D on this looks fantastic, let me tell you. You can't see it in 3D, but it's like popping now. This is one of the later 3DS games too. So I think they like, they nailed it here. This came out in 2018. I literally just looked that up before I... Uh, Started going live because I wanted to put that in the title. Make people know that this isn't the GameCube version. Alright. Yeah, the 3D looks fantastic. Get this ball. Come on. Ah. Oh. There we go. Did I miss him? Good. 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 All right. Throw the balls again. Let me catch him on the stream. Is your name just Joey on Switch? Yes. <laughs> if you dress as Mario, you need a beer gut. No, no, no beer gut. No beer gut. I'm not doing the beer gut. I'll, I'll do the overalls. I will do the red shirt. Maybe I'll even wear a hat, even though my hair is not suited for a hat. Maybe I'll get a nice fake mustache. But I'm not, I'm not getting the beer gut. I'm telling you that. I've noticed though, since I stopped running, because my 5K is done, I, um, I've been putting the weight back on. I, I should start running again. I'm trying to like, I'm trying to like, um, keep hold myself accountable by planning another race. I might do the Miami half marathon, so I gotta start training for that. The only thing is I couldn't get a guaranteed spot, so I'm on a wait list for that. And I find out in December if I got it or not. And then the marathon, or the half marathon, is at the end of January. So I, regardless, I gotta keep training. I gotta keep running at the gym. I haven't run since that half, which was on October 1st. It's already 
October 13th. I haven't run in almost two weeks. You know that? I lost 10 pounds while I was training, and I feel that's slowly coming back. I was feeling good about myself. I was noticing the double chin going away. Maybe I was getting a jawline in there. But I was also getting small. Wasn't able to lift up as much weight when I was doing uh, other exercises at the gym. So there's, there's pluses and there's uh, drawbacks to everything. All right, come on, baby. I, mean, I tell you the thing that's annoying is waiting for this guy to throw the balls. Because I'm just dodging him. I'm, I'm entirely at his mercy. It's whenever he decides to throw his little balls at me, do I get a chance to advance the plot. All right, go ahead. He's got me. Here's the ball. Oh, I missed him. I agree the game looks great on the 3DS. People hate the 3D feature, but I, lo I love the 3D on the 3DS. I think it looks, I think it looks beautiful. I just think it like really disorients some people. It does not disorient me. I like the pop of it. I like the depth. And I feel like it helps playing some games to like have a sense of depth. There we go, we got the baby. All right. Oh, welcome Clovis. I don't, it makes me feel dizzy using the 3D feature on the 3DS. Like it really have to work hard looking at the screen right away. I don't know, my eyes are pretty good at adjusting to it and I, I love having that feature. The only time in which I did not enjoy the 3D on the 3DS is when I was playing Batman or Arkham Origins Blackgate back in 2013, 10 years ago and I was playing it in the back of one of my friend's cars, and I was getting a little disorientated doing that. I think it was probably because I was like trying to focus in on this while the car was moving, and it was giving me some kind of motion sickness, but as long as I'm stationary in my basement and the lighting's good, lighting from the 3DS is good, I'm holding it in place right in front of me, I haven't had an issue like this. Moral of the story, don't play a 3DS in your friend's car when you're driving through old zigzaggy roads in Connecticut. Yeah, many people get dizzy. Chauncey. The name Chauncey, that, that is funny. Um, my grandpa on my dad's side, when he was alive, whenever he was like making up a name for someone, he would always like come up with Chauncey. Like, who's that guy over there? I'm like, what guy over there? He goes, you know, Chauncey over there. I'm like, grandpa, there's no one over there. He's like, I don't know, Chauncey. He's probably talking about this little ghost man. What do you want to do, Luigi? 
I want to go to the mansion. 3D feature on the new 3DS models a million times better. It has an eyeball tracker on it, which actively works, help keep your vision on the 3D working. Yeah, this is the um, this is the new 3DS one. This is a Japanese version, actually. This is the Japanese new 3DS. I, I imported this from Japan. We hacked it, so that way it could play like all kinds of games. It's not region locked anymore. It's actually a lot of fun doing, even though I'm not the best at um figuring out computer stuff. I was able to do that on my own. Let's save with the toad. Nice. Hugs. Hugs to you too, Hannah. Is awesome. Where's the dog? Chauncey. Ah, that's such a f old fashioned name. Kabawana. All right, where's the dog? Where's you see a little dog? bit of him. He's right there. There's the dog. Oh, that's that's not the one that I was looking for. There we go. You can just call me Hannah. All right, Hannah. Well, you, you know what? I have to elaborate that you are awesome because you were there on the first stream that we ever did, ever. And that's pretty sick. Or the first stream from a video game ever. You were there for the Mario. That, that was like the first time we streamed. Like there was a test stream and then there was like an actual, okay, we're going to sit down and we're going to play a game stream. My first stream was Mario Party. Mar Mario Party uh, Superstars. So the first time I ever streamed on my own channel playing a game. All right, so it's pretty specific, but she was there, fellas. She was there and she's back. And it's been a while. It's been a while. Because I could, I guess you could go technically the first time I've ever streamed was on my cousin Frank's channel, and we played Mario 64. But the first time I ever play, streamed from my channel was a test stream. And the first time I actually streamed for real, I played... Good, good. That's why I got to look at the map and not get wrapped up into the stories, but I'm going to do them anyway. You better be on Twitch. Mo I've been on Twitch. I, I have been on Twitch. You could see a backlog of my VODs I, I have on Twitch. And I, you could also check out my YouTube channel, which I've been trying to put up almost all my streams on, but there are some that I'm inevitably, inevitably missing on there. I think you could see the video uh, on my YouTube channel of the stream in which we played Mario Party. It's up there in the top right corner. It's at my cousin Joey. So if you just type that into YouTube, you'll find some of my Twitch streams. I'm going to be going on tomorrow with my cousin Frank. We're going to be streaming from my house. And we're going to be playing, we're going to be finishing up Castlevania. It's going to be our third night doing Castlevania Symphony of the Night. And then we're going to go into Metroid. Um, we're going to be doing Super Metroid on the SNES. So that's what's going on for us tomorrow night. And then when my brother's here, we do Pokemon Coliseum. And that's a long game. Still working on that, and now this is going to be my alone game. My old alone game was Mario 3D Land, Super Mario 3D Land, and this is my new alone game because it's spooky season, and we're playing some spooky games. Something, something a little cartoonishly scary. Cartoony scary. Not really scary, but like... Nice to set you in the Halloween spirits. And then I'm going to TwitchCon next week. Looking forward to that. Heading over there next Thursday.
Ah, Sunny, Sunny Buoy. I was on there on the test stream, but I didn't talk. Okay, I see you. Seems more lively. Yeah, you know, it's 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 fun because we got someone to talk to, and Frank's been doing this for a while. He is a pro. I've learned everything about Twitch through him. Cleaning up all the spider webs. It's also good to have him on there because he exposes me to these games that I would not otherwise play. Such as the Castlevania. And then I have him play some modern games sometimes. Upon occasion. So Frank was streaming last night. I popped in, I didn't say anything, but I just I saw he was on. And then he was he texted me today saying that he was um he was he was number three on retro for last night, which is pretty cool. He said he got a raid, but he wasn't able to stay on for a while because he had work the next day. Today. See I don't have work tomorrow. So I can be on. But I do have to pick up my mom's new car with my father. And we're going to surprise her with it. See, my mom had her car totaled because she was hit by a truck, a parking lot, that was backing up and it didn't see her. My dad recently got a new car and he's going to surprise her with it tomorrow. So whenever he decides to wake me up for that, I have to tend to that. But I'm going to be on here for a good few hours. Uh, the... Oh, no, no, this guy got me. This guy got he, he, the ghost. Nothing like a nice two for one. Another key. I feel like there'd be something in this bathtub. No. Okay, maybe the thing behind there. No, it just keeps moving the curtain. Okay. thought you and Frank would be at his place Friday. That was originally the plan, but the thing was we did not beat Castlevania. And because we didn't beat Castlevania, it's here on the save file on this Xbox. So we have to finish it before we move on. Like, I, I, need, to, I need to finish this game. Not as enthusiastic. I mean what I say. Thank you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm catching up here. Um, oh, Hannah, that, th thank you. A wonderful person and a good streamer. I appreciate that. Very nice of you to say. I'm still new on here. It's been, it's been about a month that we're doing this. And that was very nice of you too, Clovis, to uh, give that gift sub. All right, let's see. See, this is a game where, like, I keep, like, staring at this because I don't know when the ghosts are going to come get me. Like, look at this. That mouse could have gotten me. This guy could have jumped down. So bear with me while I catch up on the chats at some points. I'm not... It's not like Pokemon where I can, like, be mindlessly mashing A. Like, this one I'm paying attention to a little bit more. Oh, my God. See, they're, 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 they're coming after me.
Oh man, Shy Guy Ghost. Got two of them. Those little devil tridents, they got a little creepy. I'm not used to seeing a little Mario character with like a weapon like that. Okay. So that was not the boss. This is the boss here. And there's two of them, and they like to dance. Do I mess with the music? Is there a music box? Maybe I'll just walk into the other room. Can't do that, can't leave. Okay. I, I don't know how I managed to just pull that one off. All right, well, we got him. Let's get those pearls. No, I'm not going to cosplay as Luigi. I'm going to be Mario. Nick's Luigi. He's younger. Plus, he's taller than me. I'm clearly a Mario. It's my channel, it's my name. some gold. Let's see what else we can find.
No, Frank will cosplay as um Frank can be um Frank's really tall. Frank could be Wild Luigi. But I doubt he'd want to be. Oh, they took my money. There's a lot of ghosts in this tiny room. I think something happens with the floor over here because... Yeah, like, look at this thing over here. I have to have that thing where I shine, I blast the light. No, no, I got it. There's a button and there's a false wall and the wall goes back and it exposes some hidden area. Yeah. All right, let's explore everything in here. Nothing on that broom, lamp on top. Nothing from that. Uh, you saw the King Boo over there? Gotta go back to the lab now. Back to the lab again. Capture each boo and weaken the group's power. But the boos, as their name implies, like to hide and jump out and scare people. You got your work cut out for finding him. Don't get all down in the mouth, my boy. That Game Boy Horror I gave you has a secret function. I knew it come in handy one day, so I developed it secretly. I call it the Boo Radar. The Boo Radar will flash red when something around, like a boo, is hidden nearby. Use it to search everywhere, Luigi. Okay. Going back to the mansion. You know, he was perfectly fine trying to hunt ghosts on his own before I stumbled in here. He should at least come in here, join me, and give me a little bit of a hand, huh? Nothing. 
Yeah, whatever. All right, come on, come out again. All right, we were in here before. And... Can't get out of there yet. Seeing if I have any keys to open up any.
It's really got a hint. Alright. Let's let's look this up. Luigi's Mansion Ghost with Candle. I don't have the fire elemental metal. All right, you know what? I don't know. I'm gonna go to the bathroom for a second. So we're gonna put on uh, be right back screen. All right, so I'm back. And while I was in the bathroom, I did look up what I have to do. I have to find some of the booze and catch them. And they're upstairs. And the game kind of threw me off. So we're going upstairs. Actually, no, let me save with Toad. And apparently I need to find all 50 booze if I want the good ending of this, or the best ending. Let's see. All right, looks like the boo radars.
All right, so we got one boo. These boos, they're all males. I think so. I'm not too sure, but there's been some female ghosts already that we've seen here. I think we had two female ghosts so far. They had the woman dancing, and then we had that other one with her hair. All right, that's, that's a bomb. I want to say that these boos are male, but they might not all be. You know, it's just, it's a spirit. You can't really tell what the, the spirit is. Seem a little masculine. All right, we got two out of 50. I want to retrace my way through all these rooms. Three boos. Be careful, Luigi. Looking for money, looking for any money that I may find. I'm gonna look for money on the chandelier and in this little thing, just a heart. Oh, what's that, is that floor moving? No, it was just my imagination. Look for money in the parlor. Oh, there's money.
Gotcha, boo. Actually, you know what? I haven't fully explored everything in here. I have to put my... Yeah, there's some money. Yeah, let's check out the hat. Looking at the spider webs. Oh, another one. Five out of fifty. Oh, there's some money. Boone here. Ooh, he went through the wall. We lost one. We got him. Thought we lost him for a second. Six out of fifty.
any any classic stereotypical haunted house has this double stairwell balcony type thing. Adam's family had that. And I think they also had something like that in Crimson Peak. The Guillermo del Toro movie. All right, so there's some booze in here. Somewhere. Oh wait, no, I do have access to that room. I am Boo La La. That's what he said. He said he is Boo La La. There you are, Boo La La. Seven out of fifty. He's in the hallway now. Uh, he's going back in here. Come on, man. They're getting harder to get. Wait, where, where'd you go? Drop the key down the toilet. Oh, don't need that.
Oh, a fortune teller's room. Nice metal bar. Oh, good. Well, there's going to be a boss somewhere in here. This is going to be disorientating because I got to look through the mirror. Oh, good. Oh, there's a boo in here now. There we go. Pim Pim. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Luigi Town, and there's still something over the thing, hmm.
more money. Another Mario 64 sound. Let's go let's get away. Let something on fire, maybe. Good.
Joshua Butler. I don't know. You plan to finish this stream? Uh, like go to bed for tonight or beat the whole game in one sitting because honestly I'm kind of slowing down a little bit right now I think this is going to be like a reoccurring thing like when I'm alone I'm going to play this one I don't know where this where this boo is and why he's not coming out bothering me. Yeah. It's been a couple hours. I might go see what's in that other room and then maybe call it. See what's in here. Ah, the music room, the conservatory. Yeah, you know what? I'm good for now. Let me go find Toad and let me save.
All right, fellas, that's where we're going to be putting a pin in it for tonight. And I will come back and play this game some point on stream when it's just me. Um, I will be taking recommendations for raids. If anyone has anyone that you'd recommend that I raid, just put it in the group or put it in the chat, and I will I will send them send them a raid, send you guys over to them. But that looks like this is going to be it for the night for me. Good night, Cinema Massacre. Who is on? All right, we're going to raid this guy because I saw he's on, and I don't know if I raided him before or not, but apparently I follow him. Maybe Frank had me raid him before. See you later. See you, to, see you tomorrow or today because um, I'm going to be going on with Frank in a few hours. When I say a few hours, I mean like at 10 o'clock my time. And we're gonna be doing um, we're gonna be doing that Castlevania and Metroid. So we'll see how fast we get through that. And that's gonna be a late one. So maybe I should get some rest in preparation for that. All right, everyone, have a good night. Thank you for hanging out with me. Hope you had a good time. See you tomorrow.